Hey guys, it's Angela. I wanted to come on here and show you a few things that I picked up from Tuesday morning on my way home from work today. And I got a couple of things in the mail. Um, first thing I'll show is this Maker's Mark um, die, die of the Month set. And this is $7.50 a month plus you pay $5 shipping and so it ends up being $12.50. And this is for October and you can see how cute it is. I really like it. I like that little leaf right there. And this little sprig. Anyway, it's, and it's got a little tiny pumpkin. And on the back, it just kind of shows you. Sorry for the lighting, but it kind of shows you what you can make with it, which is really cute little card. Um, last month we got the um, haunted house one, and I haven't done anything with it yet, of course, because I've been so mega busy. Anyway. So, I'm um, sorry I didn't get a chance to cut these out, but I literally just got them out of the mailbox and brought them upstairs to show you. So, I think they'll be really cute compared to those ones that I just got from the leaf ones. The, um, Doris ones that I got from AC Moore that I was disappointed in. These at least will give, it looks like will give some embossing. So, that's really good. Even though they're much smaller, it's still really cute. Um, I think it's really cute. So, call for a month for that. Um. The next thing I got was the Hero Art card kit. I got this. I saw Jennifer McGuire showing it, making the little shaker tags. I don't have any snow globes, so um, dies. So I thought this would be a good. Um, my doggie's coming. She's really cute. She had the baby. Sorry, she's interrupting. But Maggie, Maggie, say hi. Yeah, hi. Look at her baby. <laughs> anyway. So, um, I did get the, this card kit in the mail, and she's going to lay right there. <laughs> and anyway, um, I was a little bit disappointed, and I also got the dies to go with my um, gift tags, the big gift tags I got, and I'll show you the coffee cup. Um, I was a little disappointed when I opened this, though, I'll say, is because the um, it came nicely wrapped up in, in a box and then it had blue tissue paper and it came with this and everybody's shown this I'm not going to take everything out and the reason why I'm not is because the snow package was opened up all over the place inside there and sorry about the glare but this is like little snow that you can put on the lighting is horrible anyway the snow you can put on in your thingy it opened up and it's all in here you can kind of see it and a lot of it built out which was kind of disappointing but anyway it came with the little hero arch gems and this is a big bag full of like seed beads and um I think it's just all seed beads it looks like oh and some sequins and then it comes with eight envelopes and card bases to make the cards and it also comes with this right here is acetate sheets so that's what's in there and then it also comes separately wrapped like this. This is the um, snow globe die. And y'all can look at Jennifer McGuire's com um, commercial. Oh my god. I'm so tired. I'm getting ready to go to bed. Um, YouTube video. And she shows some really cute um, shakers. And this, these, this is the base. And of course all the cute little things you can put in it. Which I thought was so adorable. You can add on other stamp sets. Um, crazy paper chick she got this and she added on the other stamp set that goes with this and it had some other animals and stuff in it but I just went with this and then um, like I said I added on some other stuff um, that doesn't go with the kit uh, and these are the little scenes you can put inside I guess you could use those on the outside of the card too I mean for other cards anyway I thought that was a really good deal um, it's $35, and it, once it sells out, sells out. It's the first Monday of every month. So I just so happened to see Jennifer McGuire's video, and I jumped on it, and I got it before it sold out, because it is sold out. Um, but, you know, I kind of feel bad showing you guys that. But anyway, um, you never know. I might sell it eventually. Um, so the other thing, I added on these little acetate sheets. Um, I just wanted extra ones. There's 20 of these, and they're 3 by 4.75. I can't remember how much they were. Oh, five dollars because so I thought it was a good deal. And then, like I said, I added on these. Um, this I got this from Doodlebugs, the actual stamp set, and um, it's the Hero Arts. I can't remember the name of it, but uh, what is this one called? It doesn't say. Anyway, um, they ran out of the die.
price, so I went ahead and ordered those. And these were $11.99. And then they sent this free. And this is Hero Arts, Hero Hughes Creative Paper Crafting Felt Decor. So these are felt stickers, which I think those were cute. That was a nice little extra. And so that was everything for that kit and from Hero Arts. And then finally, like I said, I went to Tuesday morning at one that I didn't go to when they had the die sale. And I did get a couple dies actually. They had this one, which I've seen several people show. And there's a skew. I went there looking for the 6x6 Christmas pads, but they didn't have any. And this one is one of the ones that I really wanted. And because I don't have any speed truffles. And I saw somebody show this, and I was like, oh my gosh, I want those. And they're only $2.99. And there's the skew. And there's three dies in there. Fly in here, my doll hates flies. She's weird. She's scared of them. So that's the size of those. That's a good size, I think. I really wanted these. I couldn't believe they were there. The other ones I wanted were the clouds, and I did not see those. I do have some other clouds though, so I'm not too much worried about it. That I got from Amazon. They're little. And I also got a Christmas one. They had this one, the Bah Humbug. I saw um, Mel B show this, and I really wanted it when she showed it. It's the one that I really wanted because I just like the, what it, the way it says. And you can actually read this one. A lot of these, you can't even read what they say. So they had one that said Tis the Season. You could hardly see what it said. I didn't get that one. And they had two creative card ones. They were one was um, just like the Santa and, and Reindeer, and the other one was the Three Wise Men, which I really like the Three Wise Men, but I don't, I didn't really want to create a card one. Anyway, I picked up these Heidi Swap Alphas. This is obviously Christmas. Um, where should the PC? Oh, it's right there. Anyway, um, red, green, and then plain red. No, red. Gold, green, and red. So, $1.99. That's the skew. Um, I saw Tina Kappa show this, and I thought it was really pretty. I love the handwriting of the beautiful. Couldn't believe it was there when I went. Um, and there's the skew on that for $1.99. These were um, by Memento, and um, they're wooden. There's a skew, $0.99, cent, but they're, I wanted them, they're little corners, and I'm trying to make mini albums, so I thought those would go really well. Um, I picked these up. These are by Momenta as well. I couldn't tell who, oopsies, not the ones that I've been up lately. Anyway, um, they're little pockets with tags, and the pockets are like um, clear in a way, like vellum pockets, and they're bright colors. They're only $0.99. Cent. And they had two of these, but only got one. I also got this artsy. They had a few things there. These are four stencils, and it's only nine nine cent. That was a good price. And they're self adhesive, and I love this one. This one right here with the waves on it. That was my favorite. It's fish scale, the Moroccan, and the chevron. Really like those for nine nine cent. Also wanted to get these for mini albums. Uh, nine nine cent. These are wood pieces. I'm going to stain them. Yep, there goes my doggie. Next. She's so full of... Anyway, and then finally I got this. I saw somebody get this as well, and I can't remember who it was now. I'm sorry. But um, there's the skew. They had two of them, actually, so people might be lucky if y'all were looking for this. Um, I wanted it. It's a self-healing self mat, and also with this ruler, and I think it's heat... No, this is not the one. Anyway, by We Are Memory Keepers. And that was only $4.99. So, half price, really. Alright, and that's everything I got from the stores lately. Um, nothing else came in the mail. I am waiting on a couple more things. It seems like it's taken forever. Oh, I ordered something from Stampin' Up. And I actually want to get something else from Stampin' Up that I saw Favored Favors use on um, some of her shaker uh, swaps she did. And... She used the Bountiful Botanicals, and oh my gosh, it was so pretty. And I wanted to get those. They're $33 with green ones, but I'm trying to be really good because I did order the Brothers Scan and Cut from HSN, and I'm waiting on that to get here. And that's, I got something else coming from HSN when I ordered the Scan and Cut. I also, also ordered four stamps, um, the 
really cute ones, um, all dressed up, Sam, so little girls. And then I also ordered um, Unity Stamp Company had a special, and they had that cute little owl and the little dressed up fox, the newest stamps release. And those were, um, they had an Instagram special, and it was $20 for all four of the new stamps. So I thought that was a great deal, so I did order that too. And something else I have coming in. <laughs> anyway, I need to quit shopping. But I did want to show, I mentioned in my last video that I hauled some um, junior legal pads. And I got like a five pack from Target and I got some yellow ones from Dollar Tree. I wanted to show you that I did end up making this. And this was from Shell, her name's Shell Fabian. I believe that's her name. And she is a Stampin' Up! demonstrator, but she used some Stampin' Up! supplies Excuse me when she did hers, but this is how I did mine. It has the little pen on the side, the little pen holder you can see right there, and that pops out. And you can put any pen there. I just have that one in there now. Anyway, I use the um, Graphic 45 um, Halloween. What is it? Tail. Oh, I can't remember the name of the nail. <laughs> anyway. And this is Alice on the front with a Cheshire cat. And I used this one paper. I, I got the, I, I showed it, I bought it on Amazon. Um, and I just broke into it. I used a chipboard piece and some of the, some big um, gems that I got from uh, Michael's. And then this is stickers from the, from part of the collection. And um, this is a sticker that I backed on orange, just cardstock, and then put four gems on, on the edges. And I also I did, um, you can see Wink Estella on her dress and her hat and her shoes. It's hard to see it. It doesn't really show that much with this light, and the light's kind of shitty. Oh, crappy. Sorry. Anyway, so that was that. And then when you open it up, it's I used black cardstock on the back. And then here's the pad that you slip in. And I covered that with the paper from the collection. And there's the cute little Tweedle Dee, Tweedle Dum. And anyway, um, I covered the top of it. And then also she showed how to do a, like a, band that you can slip the pad over so you can inter take this out so you don't have to just attach it to the back of this and get rid of it whenever you're done. You can switch them out. So I thought that was really cute and I didn't do anything with the back yet. Um, I finished that just the other night. It took me about an hour or so to do it because, you know, I was trying to follow directions step by step. So I love the way that turned out. I'm going to make some more and um, I like the colors of it. Halloween Wonderland, that's the name of this. Sorry, by Graphic 45. Anyway, that's everything I got. I hope everybody's having a good weekend so far. I'm working all weekend, but I had a few minutes to stop and show you some goodies. I'll talk to you later.